everyone welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is ploy and my channel is about fashion travel and lifestyle blog in today's video i'm gonna talk about fashion category it's gonna be the wedding edit and it's gonna be the first wedding edit i have done uh, i have reviewed wedding shoes some time ago like very long ago last year but i'm gonna do this again and i'm gonna include everything not just sh wedding shoes but also accessories headbands and accessories that i've used in my wedding so today we have the betty johnson um then batley mishka and then i have lovisa and accessories from etsy now let's get started Let me start with the Betsy Johnson pairs of shoes. This pair is really, really pretty. So it's in a very pastel blue. As you can see from the camera, it's a bit of a shiny satin material. And the height of these uh, pairs of shoes is around four inches height. And it's very thin. And then you have a big bow at the behind here. It's a very shiny, big size bow, but it's very pretty when you walk. It's gonna be sparkle when you walk and it's very outstanding. I really love this detail. I bought this, this uh, wedding shoes from David's Bridal. Uh, it seems that they collaborate with Bessie Johnson. I'm not 100% sure, but they have a product on, as a Bessie Johnson brand in David's Bridal website. You can see that it is in blue, but that is because my wedding theme is in blue theme like uh, something blue kind of theme i find blue theme is very pretty and i want to have a hint of blue in you know in what i wear and i choose it to be in the blue tone in the blue shade of like a pastel blue shade when i wearing this so it's matched with my bridesmaid i love its quality it's great in my opinion so i paid around almost a hundred sing dollars for this now let's talk about uh, the comfortability like whether it's comfortable when i wear this i would say yes it is comfortable this part will not give you any blisters it's very soft leather and if i want to recommend i would say definitely you have to be the person who comfortable with these types of heel and other than that it's all good now let's move on to these so 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 beautiful uh wedding shoes from Betle Mishka, I hope it pronounced correctly. I bought from Amazon website and directly shipped from the US to Singapore. Um, because on their official website, they don't have my size available, but they still have the design available. Again, I will put the link in the description box down below as well if you are interested to go for this one so this one is pricier it's more expensive than the Bessie Johnson and many of the shoes options in Davis bridal website this is a uh, very I would say many people go for this brand when they're looking for the wedding shoes this brand was recommended by my close friend that she go for uh, this brand as well during her wedding and then i feel that the design is something that i like and i think it goes well with tie dress because tie dress uh, has a lot of sparkles and everything and this pair should be the perfect one that match well with the dress the shoes model name is quintana crystal ornamented pump i might misspelling it i will put the full name on the screen for your reference so it's cost 245 usd based on that website and they are a total of two colors available 
they are latte and ivory the one that i bought that you see right now is in ivory so it's not super white as you can see from the screen it's a bit gold i would say it's not quite ivory but rather towards the champagne rather than ivory white so the latte will be a bit of the rose gold shade which i didn't pick that because it doesn't really match my dress for the details information about these wedding shoes uh it seemed like um match material they put it nylon mesh material with a little bit of the crystal along the area over here and then this the material here is satin i think it's satin in the front part as well and the heels height is also four inches so it's exactly the same with the previous uh, bessie johnson shoes that you just saw inside here is like a sparkle very pretty reflection like light go shade which is really very pretty and make it looks very luxury when you look at it from over this size but when you wear it you won't see it anyway but what is very outstanding is the crystal part over here i find it look like a butterfly you know i, I don't know if you see the same thing but i find it like a butterfly in front over here and then uh, it's all crystal you see all the detail is all the crystal material in front is a small crystal material but this is like tons of the crystal over here and it sh will reflect a lot at your wedding if you love those kind of look that you look very elegant look very like everything like sparkle you know if you love that shade go for this one i really highly recommend it something to note about these when they deliver this pair um, they also have an extra crystal in case it fall off i also very afraid that this one will fall off i don't find it's easily to fall off i don't have any fall off crystal at all i tried on many times and i try on several times in the boutique because i have to try on my wedding gown and i travel with this back to thailand so this pair has been like packed in the package in and out several times so it's still there everything is still fine in a very perfect condition regarding whether it is comfortable when you wear it i am the person who have very wide feet and have a big toe too but i don't find any problem with this pair of shoes at all maybe because i use the mesh materials that i don't want to use full leather material because i'm afraid i'll get a blisters now i'm going to compare the heel height and the heel size of uh, both brands so my left side is a bessie johnson from david's bridal website and then this side is a bachelet mishka and as you can see the height is around the same and the size of the the heel this one is slightly slimmer this one is slightly bigger but this one is right like very thin this one is very thin heel so for uh for your information this one may be a bit harder to walk but if you are comfortable with these types of heel and then it should be fine I'm going to talk about my headband. I have a total of two headbands, but I only use one unfortunately because this goes with my makeup and hair and the shade of my gown. I'm going to start with this one first in silver. Initially, I thought my gown is gonna be in the shade of ivory, but in the end it's in the champagne, that's why I went for this. So 
this one will go well with ivory shade or white shade because it's in cool tone, it's in the silver. I got this headband uh, in the vintage style, so it's got a lot of flower in this side and then lesser on the other side. I can insert some photo if I still can find it. Uh, it can be adjusted in terms of the size of the you know like size of your head whether it's a bigger head or smaller and you can adjust accordingly uh, the design is very pretty you have a little bit of mixture of pearls and crystal and pearls again and you can move it as well it's very flexible like i want to move the uh, leaves over here then you can adjust it a little bit here and there i wanted to come out a little bit like you can play around it's very flexible in, in terms of adjustment and this piece uh i got it from david's bridal website together with that uh, Bessie Johnson shoes that you uh, saw earlier so I bought them together and it's really beautiful piece but it's just that I didn't get a chance to wear this so it's still in a very brand new condition as I probably uh, have a plan to let this go sometime soon as well uh, if I got a chance but so far that is the review that I have because I didn't really wear it Now because the gown that I choose, I went for the champagne shade. So these gold um, headband, like full of flowers and pearls and crystal is the one that I went for. It's slightly bigger than the other one. So you can see the one from David's Bridal is a little bit smaller. And this uh, gold one on my right hand side is slightly bigger. But the size can be adjusted accordingly. This one is heavier as well because of the de de details that it full of the flowers and everything from here in the middle is a, a lot more uh, i got this piece from etsy uh, the link in the description box down below too and i have a few in my wish list though i will link those two like my options over there and then you can have a look over for your option as well selection on etsy they have a lot of wide range of price and the price that i'm looking at is around or lesser than a hundred sing dollars this one is around 90 sing dollars so it's within my budget because of the quality is handmade and it's very it has this uh, material i don't know what it's called but it's making the beautiful white tiny flowers over here and then they have pearls and a bit of crystal and the leaf is all in gold shade which is super pretty Now next I have the necklace and earring from uh, Lovisa. Both of them are from Lovisa. I went down to Lovisa's store and check out the how are things like and how sparkle it is because I cannot really find whether it is sparkle or not or how is the quality like. If I choosing the online then I might pick the wrong one. I want to see it in the real actual product so I went down to the Louisa uh, uh, branch nearby my house. This one that you are seeing right now is like a flower design. I think the stone that they using is a cubic zirconia. It's really pretty in the real life. It's very sparkle, super super sparkle and it looks pretty, really nice uh, when I, I wear it with the gown so if you have like a deeper neck so this one is gonna go uh, well with it because it's in the shape of like that you know like it's gonna go well with a deep v-neck kind of gown and then i also have the other one that i bought as a set here this one is in full uh, like a diamond stimulant material and it's all like full until the end and yeah, this one also you can adjust the the length of the necklace as well to be the longer or shorter. I really like the details of the circle shape here. I feel it's very luxury and it's super super sparkle. So I really like the quality here. And by the way, Lovisa is some uh, accessory that's really affordable. It's not overly expensive. It's definitely less than a hundred sing dollars, and I can buy like uh, maybe like one or two, and then see which one that fit my gown. It also comes with the earrings, but I didn't use it because, as I mentioned to you earlier, I didn't do the earrings 
magazine so I cannot wear these types of um, uh, earrings Louisa has actually has a lot and lots of the design on their website you can check it out on their website price this really makes sense with the quality they got and I love the varieties that they have on the website you can slowly check it out and look through it and think about it and see which one will fit your gown and look best on your most important day and that is all about my wedding shoes that I really really wear it on my wedding day and my wedding accessories. I hope you like with this video and please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe to my channel in the bottom uh, right down below. This is a quick heads up about next video. It's going to be about a wedding edition as well, part two. And it's going to be about my wedding ring, my engagement rings and wedding bands. So if you are keen and want to know what I got and what I'm wearing, sometimes I wear my engagement rings in the video as well and if you want to know where it is from don't forget to subscribe to my channel so please stay tuned and see you again in the next video bye